Hi, just a little unboxing and sort of first impressions video today. Um, you probably won't recognise the logo or the name of also, um, but the world seems to be going crazy at the moment for EDC spinning tops. Um, the tough guys of Instagram who normally take photos of the knives in their pockets the guys from the usual suspects network um, suddenly everyone's got little metal tops uh, that they're carrying around with them they love pocket trinkets um, and I am very easily influenced so I've been watching things on on YouTube uh, looking at the uh, the photos that people post and I started to think maybe I need uh, a pocket top or something to play with on my desk so there's a lot of brands out there Upside Down Works, Billet Spin, um, all getting very hard to get your hands on and getting very pricey, certainly on the secondary market. Then I spotted also on, on Kickstarter. I'd missed that one, but um, picked it up on the, the back of kit um, deal. So if we just open this up, you know, just starting off here, the packaging, absolutely fantastic, really nice um, sort of customer experience. Take the top off there little sticker and there's another sticker sort of sealing the envelope that this came in a sort of authenticity card number 293 this one and then tucked in this uh, sort of paper straw is the top itself and there you have it Let's see if I can just focus so as I say, this was on Kickstarter, and then lastly, back a kit. Um, this ran at £25 delivered to the UK, um, which given the, well, given the fact it's all handmade, multi-piece construction, ceramic tip, bearing point, you know, I, I think it's absolutely fantastic value for money. Um, this is what's known as the uh, Mark I Performance. There is also the Mark I uh, Standard, and I think the difference between them is that this one's got the knurling up here to give it a bit of grip, and it's also got a ceramic tip as opposed to a stainless steel tip. Now, both of them are the same price. I guess it's which one ever, whichever one you fancy, but I thought it was pretty much a an obvious choice to go with the one with the sort of upgraded uh, knurling and the upgraded tip. There's also options on both, both the standard and the performance to uh, swap between ceramic and stainless steel and also for an additional cost a, uh, a ruby, I guess it's a synthetic ruby, um, which I think adds about £15 to the value. So as I say, you know, £25, nice buyer experience handmade by a chap in the UK, a gentleman called Will Cutler. Um, really, really pleased with it. It's a four-piece construction, as I say. Uh, Will's got a, a YouTube channel, so please subscribe to that. He's got a very nice video of uh, how these are put together. Um, what he seems to be doing is that he uh, machines each of the three metal components, the fourth being the the tip there, but he machines the, the metal components first and then push fixes them together. So basically, you know, very high tolerances, they just slot together, um, but it's got like a interference fix fit, no adhesives or anything like that. Um, looking at videos and, and other things online, certainly for upside down works, um, what they tend to do is, is press fix everything together, and then build it all in one go on the lathe. So, not sure which one's best, but certainly Will's got it down for these. Um, so, I've had a few spins. I won't embarrass myself on camera because uh, my technique really isn't down. Um, and I think it would just zoom off the camera. On the back of an old plate, um, not the ideal uh, location I can easily get um, approaching eight minutes spin. Um, speaking to Will, you know, the, the best spins being achieved on, as you'd imagine, sort of concave mirrors, concave lenses, um, which keep this top 
fixed in one place rather than letting it weave around where it's losing energy. Um, it seems like you know you can get up towards 15 minutes spin on it, which I think would universally be agreed to be a, a pretty good time for any top of this size. So yeah, as I say, absolutely fantastic, very accessible, you know, no mad secondary market yet. Um, if you want one, Google Vorso, and I think he's, he's posting them on his site. I think they are going up to £35 delivered, but still, small money to be honest. Um, yeah, accessible, good value, handcrafted, nice packaging, um, UK maker, very, very happy with it. So I think the next thing for me to do is um, go out and get myself a, a cheap cosmetic mirror or something like that and see if I can get some uh, longer spin times. Um, if I get that mirror shortly, I might tack it onto the end of this video. Um, if not, I'll post a video subsequently and see what, what sort of times I can get. As I say, check it out. If you're into pocket tops or you want to dip your toe, I think this is a great place to start. Um, I'm certainly very pleased and... Uh, yeah, not big money, but a fantastic little top. Okay, thank you very much.